All right, good morning. We're going to start with Spectrum Pharmaceuticals. Again, the current conversation is 4.25 standard deviations, more positive, and it has a high relative tweet volume. So this is a, a signal that has very, very positive relative to historical benchmarks. So going forward, open the close 54% of the time, it's higher on average of 1.7%, and it's happened 31 times over the last year. So that's what all these numbers mean. M&A activity, technical price action, and downgrade, this is what the conversation is about on Twitter uh, based on our machine learning. All right, number two, FTAC, fuel tech. 30% of the time, it's positive. So this is a pop and drop, an average of negative uh, 0.37%. Upgrade insider options are the topics that people are talking about. ASRT, and th there's been a lot of popping around since I started looking at this. Now, both times, it's only happened two times, but both times it's been higher by an average of 2.18%. So that's one that, although we don't have a high number, both times it's moved higher. M&A, technical price action and downgrade. Pepsi's moved up this sentiment scale 53% of the time it's positive um, but you know negative 0 0.04 but it's a higher 53% of the time earnings macro and technical price action a lot of people say Pepsi's a bellwether for the overall economy here we have GM uh, GM 21 times 52% of the time it's higher on average of 0.24% earnings dividends and option activities all right let's check the, the short side Fox, both these are related to Tucker Carlson, and it's pretty much a 50-50 uh, historically when Fox has had a negative sentiment level. People are really bearish on them dropping Tucker. Uh, tenable holdings, negative 38% of the time, an average of negative uh, 0.05. So usually it goes up, uh, but uh, the average is negative 13 times it's happened. FRC we're going to hit on. So FRC, First Republic Bank, 83% of the time it's lower, six times, an average of 12.46%. So that's a good one. Earning short squeeze, technical price action. And then, again, future uh, historical returns are not necessarily predictive, but it's nice to have good statistical significance here. 13 times, it's been negative 61% of the time, an average of 0.21% on that one. And then we have, there's one more in here that I wanted to talk about. Um, did I say UPS? Yeah, 58% of the time it's negative, negative 0 0.04. Let's look on the short squeeze lift. We are going to be we are going to be changing the way this is calculated to get securities that are being talked about more abnormally on the short squeeze thread because what we're seeing here is a lot of the same. AMC um, here usually GameStop, Apple, Tesla, First Republic, BBBY, uh, Tiziano Life Science, TLSA, uh, Mullen Automotive, and Microsoft are on here as well. For earnings today, we'll see what's happening. We've got GATX currently with negative sentiment, AMX with positive, UBS, NEE, KMB. A lot of names on the earnings report list today. And then we can look up Apple is currently slightly positive, 0.4, and Tesla. And Tesla is slightly negative. All right, have a blessed day, everybody.